Have you ever wondered that how green plants are standing tall in this 45 degree C? Plants have developed several mechanisms to tolerate high intensity of light. One of the most important mechanisms is photoprotection, which involves the production of various pigments that absorb excess light energy and dissipate it as heat or fluorescence, thus preventing damage to the plant's photosynthetic machinery. Here are some of the key ways in which plants tolerate high intensity of light. 1. Pigment production. Plants produce pigments such as carotenoids and anthocyanins that absorb excess light energy and protect the photosynthetic apparatus from damage. Chlorophyll, the primary pigment involved in photosynthesis, can also act as a photoprotective pigment in certain circumstances. 2. Non-photochemical quenching, NPQ. NPQ is a process in which excess light energy is converted into heat and dissipated away from the photosynthetic apparatus. This process is regulated by the xanthophyll cycle, which involves the interconversion of various pigments in response to changes in light intensity. 3. Regulation of gene expression. Plants can regulate the expression of genes involved in photosynthesis and photoprotection in response to changes in light intensity. For example, plants can upregulate the expression of genes encoding photoprotective pigments or down-regulate the expression of genes encoding photosynthetic proteins in response to high light. 4. Movement of chloroplasts. Some plants can move their chloroplasts within their cells to optimize their exposure to light. This movement is known as chloroplast photorelocation movement and allows plants to minimize damage to their photosynthetic machinery under high light conditions. Overall, plants have evolved a range of strategies to tolerate high intensity of light, allowing them to thrive in a wide range of environments. Subscribe for more videos like this.